Windows Server is responsible for drawing graphical elements on display, and most of the time, you won't even have to think about it. But if it starts using lots of CPU cycles, your Mac can slow down. Here are five ways to fix it. Before we dive in, subscribe to our channel and like this video so you never miss out on our helpful content. First, let's check if Windows Server is overusing CPU resources. Go to Activity Monitor. Click the top of the CPU column. Look at the names of the processes in that column. If Windows Server is near the top and takes up more than 60% of CPU resources, you know it's using more processing power than it should. Let's try closing unneeded windows. The more windows you have open, the harder Windows Server has to work, consuming more of your CPU's processing power. Press Option Command Escape to launch the Force Quit menu and close apps you do not use. If your Mac is struggling and often runs slowly, Clean My Mac Smart Care feature can help. It runs five routines in one go, allowing you to clean up junk, neutralize threats, optimize performance, update apps, and remove duplicates. By clearing out old, unnecessary junk that slows down your Mac, the app helps make your Mac faster and more responsive. Follow the link in the description to download Clean My Mac and give it a try. Many of us rarely restart our Macs. We close the lid when we're done and open it again when we're ready to work. However, restarting helps free up memory and delete caches and other temporary files, helping to fix any errors in the process. If your Mac still feels slow after the restart, you should investigate that. Here's a video explaining why your Mac may run slowly and how to fix it. Reducing the number of open desktops can help lower Windows Server's CPU usage. Here's how. Swipe up using three fingers or press Control up arrow to enter Mission Control. Hover your mouse over any unused desktops. Click on the X in the corner of the desktop to close it. Features like transparency in Windows also use more CPU cycles. You can't turn off every visual effect, but you can switch off transparency. Go to System Settings, Accessibility, Select Display, Enable the option that says Reduce Transparency. That's it. What helped you reduce Windows Server CPU usage on your Mac? Share in the comments and see you next time.